In this uh, session, I'm going to talk about how do you really share your dashboards, right? What are the various procedures that Tableau offers if I want to share my dashboards online? Because we have already discussed that one of the key aspects of any dashboard is a proper communication. And I should be able to share the information to the right audience, right? An interest in the important aspect. I should be able to share the data with the right audience at the right time to the right people in the right format. So this entire thing has to be met. Then only we are providing a good dashboard. Now, what we are simply saying is, from the Tableau standpoint, there are different ways in which I can share the data so that my team members can really track it, monitor it, and analyze the metrics that are coming out of it. So, if there are so many such kind of mechanisms, what is the best? What is the best way? It is purely based on the requirements of the user. Now, if I quickly talk about, let's say, I have Tableau users. They do not have access to data. They really don't have access to data. The best way for me is export the entire workbook as Tableau packaged. Lot of things get packaged when I'm exporting it as Tableau package. But if my objective is to view the data online, I want to view the data online and then share. Right? In that case, I can very well share my workbook with Tableau public. We'll talk about how we do it. I can share my workbook with Tableau public. Right? So we'll look at the mechanisms. So when we are exporting a workbook as a Tableau package, lot of things are wrapped. The data is wrapped as a part of the Tableau workbook. So you are sending the workbook to someone who does not have access to the data source. You are sharing the data with them. And this is not online, this is offline. So you may find it quicker to develop something offline rather than online. So anytime when we are saving our workbook as a packaged workbook, lot of things are packaged into it. So the workbook, whatever we are saving, it creates its own internal copy of the data. So it is not the data source. There is one more copy of the data that is internally created via the data source connection. So it is packaged with the data extract. So which means this package will not reference to my original data source. It refers to a copy of the data that got created through this connection. So if people are playing around with this, they are opening this package and workbook and working on it. They are working only on the copy of the data but not on the original data source. So the workbook is purely insulated from the changes in the original data source and uh, whatever are the changes people playing around with this packaged workbook, they are not impacted by the changes in the values of the data source. So they can still, they can still play around with the workbook, they can still manage, manipulate the data, but the original data source changes will not impact it in any way. And the same thing, if I want to make it or share it online, 
So I want to save it to the Tableau public. So I have to use that particular workbook which has a package and a data source. So I have to first create a package and data source and then only I can publish that kind of a workbook to Tableau public. Of course, there are uh, quite a few criteria that uh, uh, are some kind of restriction that they put in order to publish the dashboard to Tableau public. So it cannot be having more than 1 million rows of data. It should be much lesser than that. And only those workbooks which have a data extract will, will look at it where the data extract exists, only they should be published to the Tableau public. So this is where I really want to be cautious whether I want to share my data with the public. And if there are multiple connections, multiple data sources, multiple connections, I need to have a data extract separately for each of the connection. So all these things and along with that, I need to have a login ID and password per login and password per the Tableau public. So with this, I would be able to upload my data and upload my dashboard and I can access it over the internet. So let's uh, get started with that and uh, look at it, how we proceed further with it. Okay, now let's uh, get started with it. So whichever uh, is the dashboard that I want to publish, I first thing I have to ensure that it is having less than 1 million records. Fair enough. And uh, I need to have a login for Tableau public. So I should really register on the Tableau website so that I get the login for it. Now I can save my workbook, right? So let me uh, go back to my Tableau screen. Let's say I'm getting a simple Excel file, the National Football League. So this is my data file. And let's say I've created some kind of dashboard on the top of it, right? I have taken uh, the teams. So I have taken the teams into the rows and probably the points per game I have taken into the columns and let's say this is the kind of chart that I have plotted, right? Or, uh, uh, so this is the kind of chart that I have plotted. Now, if required the same, I can plot it with respect to target as well. So what I can really see if I want to use a bubble uh, bullet chart in this case, the simple way I look at is I'll bring two columns. One is the passing yards per game and the other one is opponent passing yards per game. I can very well uh, do that to see whether my passing yards are more compared to that of my opponent or vice versa. So probably I can take one as the target and one as the actual and I can still go ahead with interpreting it as a bullet chart. Now let's see that I'll pull the passing yards per game. So I have got it uh, here and uh, if required, I can even pull the opponent passing yards as well, right? Opponent passing yards also I can get it, okay? So into the columns, I'm even getting the opponent passing yards. So here you could see both of them like this and I don't want to keep it in this way. I want to keep it in this way. So which is what is uh, showing that Okay, for Arizona Cardinals, the passing yards per game is this much, whereas the opponent passing yards per game is something here. So I could uh, clearly see uh, whether the passing yards per game is higher or the opponent passing yards per game is higher. Right? Uh, so the uh, opponent, okay, the opponent passing yards is what is being shown here. And the passing yards, the the, the, the 
this particular uh, team's passing yards per game is 254.1, whereas the opponent is 232. So mine are higher than mine um, that of my opponent. So this is the way it is finally coming out. All right. Now what our objective is, whatever is the chart that we have created. Now I want to publish this. So I want to save the workbook so that I can upload it to the Tableau public. So I'll do a save as a packaged workbook. So I go to the file. I do a save as. And so I may provide some name. Probably uh, this is called as NFL package. Let me just give some name NFL package. And within this, let me uh, save it as Tableau packaged workbook. So the packaged workbook will get saved as .twbx, whereas the regular workbook will get saved as .tbx. TWB. TWB is a Tableau workbook. TWBX is a Tableau packaged workbook. So now first thing I can save it. Right? Then once I have saved it, I'll go to the server. And in this server, I'll see the Tableau public. Right? So, in this Tableau public, I am seeing it as save to Tableau public as. So, I am uh, getting here save to Tableau public as. So, I can very well click on the save to Tableau public as. Then it connects. Okay, so there is uh, a Tableau public sign in. I may have to uh, give my credentials out here. Right, I will give my credentials out here and I am signing. Okay. like I have uh, forgotten the stuff so we can very well create one for free so you can create your profile so I have retrieved uh, my password uh, kind of stuff so let me just check now okay so I am able to log in now so, I have, I, right now I have to uh, save with some package name. So, I have already given NFL package. Right, so I have signed in with my login ID and password and uh, I got this. So, I will save. I give the name and I will save it. So, it is very much showing data extract is required because we did not extract the data at only the workbook we try to publish. So it is saying that the data extract is required. The Tableau server you are publishing to does not permit external database connections. So you, I have to use the data menu to create an extract for the following data source. So for this data source, I have to create an extract. So I should create a data extract. And for that, I get a kind of a filter box here. So I want to extract all of the data. So I really don't need to put any such kind of stuff. I can simply say extract. I want to extract all of the data. So I have simply selected extract. Now. Let me again uh, try it. I go to server, Tableau public, 
save to Tableau public as NFL package. I am saving it. Yeah. Now it is publishing the view. And once it is uh, published, I will be able to see it in my internet browser like this. Right, it will open the same in my internet browser. The whole thing is saved on the net. And I get this is the typical location where my, uh, uh, where my published dashboard is like. And I can edit the details. Right, this is uh, the, the package name and all that stuff. So, fine. So, these are the details associated with this. So, I can very well look at this particular data on the sheet here. So, I have my, my dashboard that is published onto the net. And if you want to share your visualization, you can link, you can use the link to share your workbook. So, this is the way you can very well save it. So, Tableau packaged workbooks are typically are saved with extension TWBX, whereas the workbooks have the regular extension of TWB. So, this is a simple way where you can uh, access your stuff, right? You can very well uh, give this uh, typical uh, link and the whole thing is accessible from any of the location. This sheet you can, this uh, link you can send it anywhere and you can access your dashboard from almost anywhere. So, you are publishing your workbook to the whole world using the Tableau Public. So, it is saved to the data centers of Tableau and you can access the workbook from anywhere in the world via the internet. So, it's very easy to publish the stuff, publish your dashboard from your desktop. A few restrictions we have talked about. The data has to be extracted and I need to be slightly careful regarding the sharing of the workbook because once the workbook is published to Tableau Workbook or Tableau Public, anyone can download the data. Now, this is the workbook. Anyone can simply download this workbook. So, I have to be slightly careful regarding this. All right. So, that's an interesting aspect with respect to Tableau where I can create a dashboard and I can even share it over the internet. Thanks a lot for listening to this uh, session. Thank you very much.